welcome welcome this is c energy vibration um reading for the month of september for the gemini sun moon horizon sign i want to say thank you for being here thank you for being back gemini's let's see what is happening this month is on her energy month um a lot of you have to deal with a situation in corporation institution i see a lot of your um females are going to be dealing with some issues and some of you who are in relationship with a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpion, I see they're going to be finding out some false height and deceptiveness that was created. So if you're in a relationship with a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpion, is this your brother or sister or partner? I see a lot of information is going to be coming out about this person. So seeking out intelligent um, solution to your problem, um, the need to stay at heart quickly and decisively, suddenly things are going to be transpiring. Some of you could be falling in love suddenly and being swept off your feet. The need to stay grounded during a very emotional experience. A lot of you who are in relationship with a Pisces, Cancer, or a Scorpion are going to be having some form of uh, um, heartbreaks and uh, um, coming and realizing lies and deceptiveness uh, um, that was created uh, around you and this person. You could be finding out that this person have to deceive a lot of you. A whole lot of worries is going to be coming up. So be aware of this. It could be a friend or a sister or a brother. Now... Let's get into your reading. The center of your reading is that some of you are going to be um, having the energy of the King of Pentacles. The energy of the King of Pentacles is building on your financial stability. Be very financial stability. Returning and healing your financial stability. However, this is happening and transpiring. I see truths are going to be coming out. Now, this is going to be a beautiful month for you, Geminis, because the energy of the sun is here. And I see you're going to, a tower moment is going to be coming down where something is going to be leaving your life in the first week where we have a fire energy, second week a fire energy, third week a fire energy, fourth week water, the um, fifth week the energy of the magician, your own energy vibration. So you're ending this month by releasing yourself from some sort of a deceptive Play, um, play that a Pisces Cancer or a Scorpion person have done to you guys. I really see this tower moment is going to be coming down where um, you're going to be finding out something about the Pisces Cancer or Scorpion person. This person has done some false and deceptive um, spelliture that created some issue in your life. And finally, this is coming to an end. Then we see some issue with a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn. And you are going to be realizing that this Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn woman is going to be helping you to resolve some sort of an issue and situation and remove you out of a very horrible play that was transpiring. Now, um, whoever this Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn person is, is going to be really supporting some of you in order to release you out of some issue and situation that you are going to be dealing with. So, um, expect um, the energy with um, an Aries, the or Sagittarius is going to be leaving your life. I see you're dealing with a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn that is going to be helping out some of you in order to resolve some sort of an issue situation that has been transpiring. Um, I see you're dealing with a young Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpion person. Truths is going to be coming out about this person. And you're going to be finally getting rid of this person once and for all. So let's check in the weeks um, one by one. So we see in the first week, you are going to be releasing a Taurus, Virgo, or um, a Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius man. Whoever this man is, whatever has been transpiring, this man could have been creating a lot of issues for you guys that you were not aware of. And what is going to be happening and transpiring is that you're going to be releasing yourself from this person. This person is an Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius. You're going to be overcoming the injustice that this person has created in your world. And I see you're going to be re regaining some sort of a financial stability in your world. Some of you, this could have been... 
um, and a professor or someone that was sort of a, using some sort of a form of a, um, uh, uh, authority figure and uh, um, some sort of a force and brute force against you. It could be a father figure. Um, it could be a stepfather. It could be um, just um, a man. It could be that you were in a relationship with this person and you are going to be, this person is going to be released out of your life. It's the Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, and it is going to bring you back some stability. It could be your child's father for some of you. But after this person is being released, is in a reverse, I see positive alignment of energy is going to be coming up. As we look forward and we're looking at the energy of the second week, it's a beautiful, beautiful energy because you're overcoming an Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. People are seeing the false side of this person and removing them out of your life. You're also overcoming this businessman or this man. This man is a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn. Whoever this man is, I see truth is going to be revealed over this man and you're going to be successfully and happily being released from the control of this man. This man is a very controlling person. Whoever this man is or was, is very controlling. And I see your worries is going to be over. Some of you could be finding out what this Taurus Virgo Capricorn man has done. And I see that this person is going to be very worried if you know what they have done. So it could be a sister, a brother, or a husband, or a partner that you are dealing with an issue in a situation. And as you see, a whole lot of you are going to be affected by the Taurus Virgo or Capricorn man because this man has created a whole lot of issue for some of you. Then we see you victoriously moving forward. Um, whatever um, there was, I see you're going to be overcoming, ending a relationship or a connection with a cancer. Whoever this cancer, some of you are now seeing um, who this person is um, and you are ending some sort of a relationship with a, um, a cancer. You're going to be successful releasing this person out of your life because this person had created a lot of chaos in your world. As we look at your center, which is beautiful, the energy of the sun is here for um, you, um, uh, uh, Gemini is the energy of the sun. You're successfully overcoming um, some false play, um, what a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn man has done, and you're standing your ground. I see you're tired, but you are coming out. You're speaking up, and you're showing up this man for the false height and deceptiveness of who he is, whoever this man is and whatever has transpired. I see you are no longer going to be worried over this person because you are letting this person um, be known that you're no longer afraid of this person. I see truths are going to be coming out. Some of you are worried about the future because I see your relationship or the future with um, a, a friend who is a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpion, a sister, a brother, or a relative, there is a, going to be some um, problems and you're worrying about the, your future going forward because you got involved with these people. So there is a lot that is coming up and transpiring for you, um, Gemini, in this month. But what we're seeing that is happening and transpiring is that you're really seeing um, this person for who they are and the connection um, that this person, it could be a, your father and your sister or brother that you were dealing with. Uh, and uh, whoever this um, Taurus Virgo or Capricorn man is, I see truth is coming out and you're going to be very successful over this man. Then when we look at the fourth week, the fourth week is a blessed week. Truths are coming out. Truths are coming out about the Taurus Virgo or Capricorn man and you're going to be very successful. Truths are coming out about uh, Pisces. Um, this person is a Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpion. Between the ages of 18 and 45, it can be a man or a woman. It can be a family member, or it could be a friend. Whoever this person is, you're going to be finding out a lot of uh, um, lies and deceptiveness. Um, this person 
what this person has done to you and basically stabbing you in your back, uh, working together with an Aries Leo, a Sagittarius man, a Taurus Virgo Capricorn man, and the false height and deceptiveness, truths are going to be coming out um, about what they have done. As we move forward, we are looking at the fifth week, and the fifth week is going to be your best week. So um, I'm going to tell you what are going to be your best week. But the fifth week is the energy of your own energy vibration, where you're standing ground and standing up against a Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpion. Um, it could be a sister, a brother, a family member, but you're going to be finding out the lies and deceptiveness of this person. So there is a lot of truths that is going to be coming out in your cross position. What we see is that the truth, some um, worries that you have dealing with a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn man is going to be coming out and it's going to be some worries that you were having that you were not aware of. This man was the man that was creating it and it can be a, a Capricorn man. So what we're realizing is that uh, a here is Leo and Sagittarius man and a Capricorn man has created some false height around and um and you're going to be realizing that either your partner or your sister or brother that is a Pisces Cancer or Scorpion and somehow work together with these two people in order to create the deceptiveness and the false height. You are going to be seeing how destructive a um a water sign person has been and this person is between the ages of 18 and 45 but you're going to be realizing how destructive this person has been a lot of you are going to be finding out that this person has been doing some unseen sort of a thing so it could be two older men one is um a sort of a fa friend of the father um and the connection that this young person had with that man was an unhealthy situation and you're going to be finding out about this so however it is going to be ending up whether or not you end the con the um end the relationship is up to you we're going to be looking at the extended of the reading so if you are a member of the channel you can see the extended of this reading and um pick it up as you are uh, uh connected to this channel so there was a whole lot of uh, um secrecy it was not secrecy now you're going to be seeing how these people have worked against you and it is all coming out because people are aware and seeing um the facts of what has happened and has transpired then we see that a young um taurus Virgo capricorn is going to be helping some of you to be successful over an issue and to get out of an issue that has been happening to you and has been transpiring with you because this person is going to be um protecting you in some sort of a way um, in order for you to release and letting you see the truth of uh, this person you're in a relationship with or the truth of this friend um, and how this friend I've connected with you and uh, um, you know it's, it's as if this person came in your life and target you target the family and target all the people now what we're seeing happening is that some of you are going to be uh, um, there's a lot of worries and issues because you're going to be finding out that someone very close to you had stabbed you in your back someone very close to you had stabbed you in your back and this is coming up it can also be a child yes sometimes um it's surprisingly because that's why we have kids and uh, you have to work out past life karmas with your kids and i see a lot of you um realize that you you have been working on past life commas with a child who a child have worked against you with their fathers okay so if they're if you have a child that their father is a Aries Leo or a Sagittarius or a um a Taurus or a Capricorn you're going to be finding out that your ch your child has worked together with your father with their father in order to work against you so it is a really really serious serious um a month that is coming up it's a month of revelation for a lot of people a whole lot of um things are going to be coming out but 
the 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 the, the such the, the 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 profound positive energy about this month is that whoever this Aries Leo or Sagittarius is is going to be removed out of your life. It could be a young um, Capricorn person could be also removed out of your life, but an older man that is a fire sign man is definitely going to be removed out of your life, and people are going to be finding out. Now the energy of the tower and the tower is affecting um uh, the tower is blowing up and it is showing up some 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 untruths untruths by a Pisces Cancer Scorpion person whoever this Pisces Cancer Scorpion person is it is going to be showing up some this is some untruth about this person, but this person did not speak the truth and it is going to be showing up this person. Then we see you're going to be overcoming a situation with an Aries Leo or Sagittarius man, whoever this person is, however this person is affecting you in your life. This person is going to be um, moved out of your life like Pluto moving this person out of your life. Then we see the energy of the sun and this energy of the sun is showing up um, something, but it is very positive because I see a young Taurus Virgo or Capricorn is going to be helping some of you um, and your financial status. However, this is coming up and transpiring. This person is going to like, you're going to be really realizing that this person has been protecting you and this is going to be good. Then we look at truths is coming out. Some truths is coming out about a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn man. Whoever this man is and whatever is transpiring, you're going to be very, very successful over this man and sex successful against who this man is and what this man has created in your life. A huge success. And this is coming up for some of you as a, a Capricorn man. Um, for some of you, it is... A, it can be a Taurus or a Virgo. But whatever this man has done and whoever this man is, I see you're going to be successfully overcoming this situation. And then we're looking at the energy of the magician. And the energy of the magician is going to be sort of a renewing something for some of you. Overcoming something for some of you. Um, you know, setting a point at some issue that some of you, whether it's um, a legal issue or what, um, you're going to be overcoming this because whatever is transpiring, um, you're going to be finding out some information. You could be divorcing a, um, a cancer person or you could be divorcing a Pisces person or um, it could be a child, but whatever is transpiring, I see you're going to be having the tools in the last um, a week in the month in order to create this stability or possibility for you. And there is some sort of a legal issue that is going on and you're going to be um, realizing how a cancer per Pisces cancer person um, has lied and they're going to be finding out. The energy of this two reverse persons that you have, um, two sort of people that you should look forward to um, that is going to be affecting your life and you're going to be finding out something. If your father is an Aries Leo or a Sagittarius and you have a brother or a sister or a family relative that is a Pisces Cancer or a Scorpion, these two people are going to be in some sort of a clinch because you're going to be finding out how they have connected with each other and how they have created some sort of a false height and deceptiveness in your world. Then we are looking at the energy that you are going to be realizing um that this person is going to be worried so go and check out the cancer reading cross watch i can't say so much that you guys need to cross watch so if you have a child a relative a friend that is between the age of 18 and 45 you have to find out and go watch their reading to see what is going to be happening to them and how does it affects you because you're going to be finding out some really serious uh, um, untruth that this person has not been speaking the truth. Some really untruth about this person that this person created some issues and some on some information and this person basically stab you in the back. And I see some of you who are in a relationship with this person, you're going to be 
you know, find in some sort of a way in order to release yourself from this person because you find out that this person has lied and deceived you and has worked with an older fire sign man. So whatever is happening and transpiring, um, be aware of this because it is all going to be coming out and you've got to be on top of your game. So we're looking at you overcoming a situation with two men, um, an Aries Leo or Sagittarius, a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn. These men are 50 years and older. You're going to be very successful. And I see um, a, a young um, Taurus Virgo or Capricorn is going to help you to remove these people out of your life. And you are going to be finding some sort of balance and your energy is going to be returned um, because um, whoever um, these people are was sucking you basically dry. And I see um, if some of you were not feeling well, I see it is going to be happening in the third week that you're going to be regain your energy and balance. Truth is coming out about uh, you and your partner whatever is transpiring if you have a partner is you and your partner or truth is coming out about some sort of a friendship that you have this friendship could be leaving your life because people are you're going to be finding out um who are these people and what is the situation that has been affecting you then we're moving and we're looking at the energy with the stars, Virgo or Capricorn man that you're going to be successfully overcoming what they have done to you. Truth is going to be coming out and it is going to be showing up um, that this young Pisces, Cancer, Scorpion person who was in your life, you're going to be finding out what this person has done and created the sum and you I see you are going to be worried because um whoever this person is is going to be trying to create some sort of an issue or has been holding you under control. So some of you are who are in relationship with this person, you're going to be finding out that this person has been using some sort of a witchcraft in order to um keep you in a relationship. And I see you're going to break out in the third week because it's as if the universe is coming in and it's releasing you from this lies and deception and showing you and letting you know that this person was using witchcraft in order to affect your life and you are going to be breaking that or your spirit guides or someone could see what they were doing and see their lies and the de deceptiveness. Gemini's, you're going to be successfully overcoming this situation um, because the sun and the magician is going to be releasing you from this relationship. Okay, whatever the relationship is with that you had with this Pisces, Cancer, Scorpion person is going to be release, releasing you from this relationship and you will have a new start. This person is not going to have a new, a new start. This person is going to end up in jail because of what they have done. There is no new start that is going to be coming up. If you notice the energy with this whole thing, um, there is no new start that is coming up for the Pisces, Cancer, Scorpion or the Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn man, because they're seeing the truth, the truth and the lies and deceptiveness of these people and truths are going to be setting a whole lot of you free. So be aware of this and whatever is happening and transpiring. Um, so as we look, what we're seeing is that whoever this um, Aries Leo or Sagittarius man is, you're going to be removing this person so that you can protect a young Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn. A tower moment is coming down on a relationship and your worries is going to be over. Um, you're moving forward and being victorious over a, 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 um, um, a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn man, whoever this man is and whatever this man has done, um, your worries is going to be over. Truths are going to be coming out and I see no new start for a um, Pisces, uh, Cancer or Scorpion in your life because of something what this person have done and how this person have worked together to, you know, push you and drag you under the bus. Truth is going to be coming out about this uh, um, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpion person, whether male or female, and you're going to be victoriously coming out of uh, um, this relationship and is from the help of a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn that has been protecting you 
without you even knowing this so it is um there is no question it's going to be accent there is going to be a like through truths is going to be told and i see that um a, a, a person who is very very educated is have seen you um the illusion of your partner or your friend or your sister and said hey look at this this is not correct it's not true what this person is saying and i see the third week because you start to worry in the fourth week because you found out that this person is not going to so it's as if um you're in, with, or in a relationship with this person and this person apply for a stay in a country or whatever and you realize that um it's a no and you start to worry but you're not aware of uh, the factors behind it and uh, the factors behind it is that people in power have realized that this person has not spoken the truth this pisces cancer scorpion have not spoken the truth and uh, that is the reason why and then when the fifth week comes in all of a sudden um this person is picked up and you're like whoa oh my god and then you're going to be finding out because it's as if whatever this person has been doing this person has been connecting with two older men um and as if they target you or your family and now truth is going to be coming out you are going to be blown away you're going to be what has just happened what is what is happening what has just happened you're going to be unbelievable surprise as to what has transpired in your world and you're going to be blown away um from this so whatever is transpiring this person is not going to, oopsie daisy not going to be having a new start i can advise you of this if this person was asking for um um like a, a stay or something it's not going to be happening um it is uh, so it says that they are going to be saying no and then when you ask the question why I, I think some of you don't have to ask the question why because this person is just going to be picked up it's so um unbelievable but it's as if this person is just going to be picked up and you're like what what is going on here and you're going to be finding out exactly what has been happening and what has been transpiring so be aware be on top of your game because you're about to find out something that you were not aware of and it can it, it can also be your partner okay so it can be your partner so um be aware um because something is about to come out about your partner um that you guys was not aware of it can be your partner it can be friends or it can be um relatives so be aware of this because uh, a huge tower moment is going to be coming in and this is going to be showing up and at the end of the month because uh, it's as if the tower moment come in the beginning of the month and then at the end of the month someone is uh, you're going to be finding out oh my god what was uh, really i was um on top of your game i gotta go namaste